Good day everyone, welcome to Senior Pablo TV. And for today's tutorial video, we will be discussing the joint variation. So in joint variation, some quantities as in area or volume may involve three or more variables simultaneously. So we have three or more variables variables in our joint variation. The statement y varies jointly as w and x means y is equal to k w x, wherein k is our constant of variation. Let us answer the following problem. Write the equation of the following variations. So let k be our constant of variation. The volume of the cylinder varies jointly as the square of its radius and its height. So we have the volume of the cylinder varies directly varies jointly as the square of its radius, so k r squared and its height h. This will be the equation of our variation. Volume varies jointly as the square of the radius and its height. So we have k as the constant of variation. Number two, W varies jointly as x, y, and z. So W is equal to jointly as x, y, and z. K as a constant of variation. Now, how are we going to find the constant of variation? So let's have this problem. D varies jointly as E and F. So let us write the equation. D varies jointly as so the constant E and F. If D is equal to 1.2, so D is 1.2, is equal to when E is equal to 0 0.3. So E is 0 0.3 and F is 0 0.4. Copy K. So 1.2 is equal to, we have 0 0.3 times 0 0.4. This gives us so 0 0.3 times 0 0.4. 4 times 3, we have 12. How many decimal places? 2, so 1, 2, 0 0.12. Okay. Now divide by 0 0.12, 0 0.12. So our k is equal to 1.2 divided by 12. That will give us 10. Okay. So the constant of variation is k. Now let's have the following examples. X varies jointly as W, Y, and Z. If X is equal to 18, when W is equal to 2, Y is equal to 6, and Z is equal to 5. Find X when W is equal to 5, Y is equal to 12, and Z is equal to 3. Now let's first find the equation of our variation. X varies jointly as W, Y, and Z. If X is 18, so after finding the equation, find the constant of variation. So X is 18, now W is 2, Y is 6. Z is 5, then copy K. Now 18 copy is equal to 
2 times 5, that is 10 times 6, so we have 60k. To find k, we need to divide by 60. So k is equal to 18 divided by 60. So divisible by 2, 9 over 30. Still divisible by 3, 3 over 10. Three over ten. So okay, three over ten. Divisible by six, six of eighteen, then three over ten. So k is three over ten. We're going to find x. So we need to find x. We need to substitute our k is 3 over 10 times 5x when w is 5, y is 12, and z is 3. Okay. Now, let us, let us use cancellation method. So 10 and 5 can be cancelled out. So this will become 1, 10 will become 2. We can cancel 2 and 12, this will become 6. Now we have 3 times 1, 3 times 1 times 6 times 3. So we have 3 times 1, that is 3. Or 6 times 3, 18. 18 times 3, we have Six, uh, 8, 16, 24, carry 2, 3, 4, 5, 54. So the value of x is 54. Next, our second example. The area of a triangle varies jointly as the base and the height. So area of a triangle is k. Let's say B is for the base and H is for the height. Write the equation of variation. A triangle with a base of 8 centimeters, so our area is, so our area is, base is 8, so we need to change B for 8, then height is 9, and the area is 36 square centimeters. So area is 36. Now we have 8 times 9, that is 72, copy K, copy 36. To get K, or to find K, divide by 72. So K is equal to 1 over 2, divisible by 36. That is 1, 72 divided by 36, that is 3. The question is, find the area when the base is 10 and the height is 7. So we have area is equal to KBH. So our K is 1 half, then our base is 10, and our height is 7. So cancellation method. 10 divided by 2, this will give us 5, and 5 times 7, 35. Since we are talking about the area, we have a unit cm squared. This will be the answer. So, that's on how to solve the joint variation. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV, and see you in our next lesson, Combined Variation.